I guess let's start with uh, Matt's performance on the mound today, starting uh, just what he brought to you. Today. That's what you need. Your Friday night uh, got us off to a great start. Really attacked the zone, uh, allowed our, our defense and offense to set it, get, get a little bit of rhythm. It was nice to score that run in the first, uh, get things going offensively. But he did what a Friday night guy did. Uh, you know, they hit the one home run uh, after we almost strike the guy out, and, and he'll learn from that. I, you know, I think he walked that guy. Um, you know, tough, a couple tough. Uh, Alex getting that third out, you know, but he's just got to learn how to finish innings. He's still a young pitcher, but the one thing we knew about Matt, well, he was going to compete, and that's why, you know, he, he was the choice to come in on Friday night and, and set the tone for this pitching staff. Can you ask for anything more out of the bullpen either? No, that, that's what, you know, I, I said that out there. You know, Derek Self, um, phenomenal out of the bullpen, you know. Derek uh, can start for us anytime we need him. Man, is he good out of the bullpen. And then, of course, Tony Zick did what everybody's been waiting to see. You know, he did that all summer in the Cape. He did that all fall and spring for us. Um, so it's nice for him to get his first save of the year. Was this organic milk for you today? Did you uh, did you get what you were expecting? Well, it was. You know, and Drew Haynes won the shirt. And, and you know, like I said, Drew Haynes is the epitome of organic milk. You know what you're getting when you open up the fridge and you pour that carton of milk. And, and that's Drew. And, and he played. You know, we stuck him in right field. He, he doesn't work in right field a whole lot. But he had to play right today. And great offensive at-bats. And and we got that extra run there, and he let off that inning with the double, so I was really proud of him. The last thing is just a freshman play today. Uh, I thought you got some nice contributions from guys their first time out. Oh, we had three freshmen start and the three sophomores. You know, those three sophomores weren't regular starters last year. So you had six new starters in the lineup. Two freshmen came off the bench and got the play. You know, so eight young kids helped us win tonight, and uh, they're talented. If they're at the University of Louisville, uh, they're talented. So, you know, it's not shocking to us. We I expect big things today. from those young guys. Uh, this year. What he did for you? Yeah, uh, Justin's dominant. You know, this time of the year, you just don't expect guys to go that long. He was very efficient. You know, he pumped the ball in the zone, uh, kept them off balance. That's a good club over there, and uh, you know, very impressive, Justin Amlo. I was gonna say, are you surprised that? Uh, that I mean, he had that success over the entire game. I mean. That he kept coming out, and then he kept figuring out different ways to get guys out, and that they never made just, the adjustment. You know, he kept his pitch count down, and we didn't do much better on their guy. You know, it was just a, a two nothing game where I thought everybody threw well for both sides, and uh, hitters weren't making great adjustments. We were very bad on the base path. Um, you know, but just impressed with Justin Amlung and happy. Uh, you know, he could have easily been the Friday night guy, and, and with Mike Nasto going tomorrow, we feel like we got three Friday night guys on the staff. How about the clutch kind of attitude of your hitting, uh, the way they came? I mean, in, in a nothing nothing game to come through in the seventh, uh, get the leadoff walk, and, and get a couple of good hits in there. That was big, uh, again, because we did not run the bases very well. Uh, five freshmen in the starting lineup tonight, uh, and it showed. You know, we're, we're, we're going to be aggressive but we also have to run the bases the right way. And so uh, not a great night offensively, but as I told the team, to uh, you pitch and play defense, you got a chance to win every game, especially early on. You run the bases in practice next week? <laughs> I believe we do it every day, so we'll, we'll double duty now. Uh, and then I guess the last thing would be uh, Zick in the ninth inning, uh, just to be able to battle back uh, and, and get the key out there. You know, you know he's going to run out there and have success. Um, what was impressive was to come back on back-to-back -back nights. Again, first weekend of the year, uh, two save opportunities in the first two games of the year. Um, he showed his composure. It was very tough.